Hi friends, welcome to Charcos. I'm Dr. Seema Balyan, the founder and director of Charcos. Charcos is a healthcare recruitment and training company with over 15 years of experience in providing turnkey solution for training and recruitment needs for the nurses, doctors, and AHPs such as radiographers, occupational therapists, ODPs, and many more. Charcos operates over three continents in countries such as UK, Australia, Germany, Italy, and New Zealand. Our services include OET and IELTS training, CV enhancement, interview preparation, NMC and APRA registration, CBT and NCLEX preparation, visa application and flight bookings, OSCE training for all fields of nursing such as adult nursing, mental health nursing, pediatric nurses, midwifery and learning disabilities. OSCE training is available in India as well as in UK. Orientation for life in UK, OSCE exam bookings and the logistics bookings. Excellent pastoral care. Our state of the art learning platform includes reading materials, videos, quiz to enhance your learning and equip you for a positive and a better outcome. For registration, CV upload, relevant bookings and more information please visit our website www.charcosglobal.com visit our youtube channel and subscribe our youtube channel by going to charcos learning center our facebook page instagram and linkedin pages by the name of charcos global so what are you waiting for subscribe now press the bell icon for regular updates and all the information that you require. We are looking forward to seeing you on our site and being a partner in your enhanced journey. Thank you very much. So, uh, capillary blood glucose sampling. Um, to undertake the blood sugar measurement is a simple uh, procedure in itself, um, but you need to make sure that you are um, doing that safely and giving the correct patient in information. So you will need to know if you don't know already. Um, in the UK, the blood sugar measurements are done millimoles per litre. So you need to know that 4.5 to 7 is the normal range for, um, for blood sugars. So um, if you're used to working in milligrams per deciliter, make sure you are familiar with millimoles um, so that you can uh, work out whether this is a normal level um, high or low blood sugar that you're giving, so you can give the right advice to your patient. Um, engine the room, checking for the scene safety, making sure it's safe to approach my patient and doing my hand hygiene before I approach. Good morning. Good morning. My name is Julie, I'm one of the nurses looking after you today. Just for my clarification, can I double check your uh, name, please? Yeah, my name is Ali King. And your date of birth? It's 1st of January 1969. Okay, can I double check that with your wristband, please? Okay. So, Ali King, and you said your date of birth was the 1st of first, 1969. And I can see your hospital number here is 0004321. Lovely, that all matches with my paperwork. Uh, what would I need for you? Oh, you can call me Ali. Ali, hey, lovely. I've come here to t test your blood sugar level at the moment before you have your uh, lunch. Is that okay? Yeah, that should be fine. Have you had this test done before? Oh, uh, yes, I have. Okay, so I'm just going to go and grab the equipment. Um, whilst I'm away, do you mind washing your hands with um, some warm soap and water and making sure they're dry thoroughly? Is that okay? Okay, that should be fine. Are you mobile enough to do that? Yes. Okay, lovely. I'll be right back with you. Um, testing kit then. Okay. I'm emptying my hand hygiene. I'm not uh, washing my hands at this time. My hands are physically clean. Um, if they weren't, I would use soap and water to clean them. Okay. 
Okay, so I have on a clean apron and gloves and I'm going to clean my equipment ready to use. So I have a packet of universal uh, wipes, which are 7% alcohol and just checking the expiry date. Uh, in dates, so I am going to take the um, wipe and I am going to clean my tray um, before I use it. Okay, so clean inside of the tray, six and a outside dispose of them in the vehicle waste. Okay. So I am going to take a shelf box, making sure that it's all completed and not over full in there. Okay, I'm going to dispose of these gloves and apron. And so my hand hygiene. So for this, I am going to need a glucometer. Um, and I have already checked that it's calibrated and safe to use. Um, so I have my glucometer and I have my test strips. I'm going to double check the expiry date on those and they are uh, safe to use. I am going to need a single use lancet which will be disposed of in the sharps box. I will need some gauze for wiping the end of the finger and this is our blood sample that we haven't yet got. And we are going to get from our patient's finger. So I'm going to need one clean pair of gloves and I'm ready to go back to my patient's bedside. Okay, I'm entering the room, checking for safety one more time, doing my hand touch. Hi, Ali, I'm back. Hello. Did you manage to wash your hand okay? Ah, uh, yes. Okay, lovely. Do you have any preference on which finger we would like to use? Um, no, but uh, it would be good if you can use my left hand, please. Okay. Mm -hmm. Do you normally do this yourself? I have done it. Okay. So, you can watch me so I'm doing it correctly, okay? <laughs> sure. Okay, so I'm popping on a pair of gloves before I start. So, I'm sure you've found by now that if you're doing your thumb or your index finger, because we use those fingers the most, it tends to get sore. So we advise not to use your thumb or your index finger, but we would um, use the two middle fingers predominantly, okay? Okay. So, um, you may well use a pen with lancets at home, but in the hospital here, we are going to use a single-use one, okay? I'm just going to get my uh, test strip out ready. This one, these are very fiddly, especially when you've got gloves on. Just one of those. I've already checked the expiry date and everything is okay. So I'm going to place that in here and I'm going to just use one of these gauzes just to make sure the tip of your finger, I'm going to use this finger, is that okay? Okay. It is dry and twist, oh, it went off, twist in the end here and I'm going to prick your finger. Okay, and just give it a moment. Here we go, let's line that up there and that's sucked up the blood that it needs and it's working. So let's wipe your finger, making sure you've stopped bleeding. And, and here we have a result of 5.2 millimoles. So Ali, your um, blood sugar at the moment is 5.2 millimoles, which is great. That's in within the perfect and within the normal range. I'm disposing of that and of my lancet into the um, sharps box there. Okay, I'm going to take my gloves off and uh, do my hand hugging. And um, that's it. I'm going to eat something to eat, uh, whatever it is that you okay. ordered. Okay. Okay. And I'm leaving you with your call bell if you need anything at all. And I just uh, post that. I'm going to absolutely not dropped off from the world. Okay. okay. I'll see you soon, Annie. Thank you.